How to fix Valorant? Vanguard requires secure boot to be enabled in order to play. After installing Valorant, you are probably trying to launch the game and you suddenly get this error message. This version of Vanguard requires secure boot to be enabled in order to play. If you are getting this error, chances are that you are trying to run this game on a Windows 11 computer. In this video, I'll explain what causes this error and how you can fix it. Vanguard is actually a security software by Riot Games that prevents players from using cheating or hacking tools. All Riot Games including Valorant are protected by this security software. For Vanguard to function properly on Windows 11, you must enable Secure Boot and TPM 2.0 features on your PC. If you are encountering this error, this means both or any one of these two features is disabled on your PC. To fix this error, you have to enable TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot from BIOS or UEFI settings. To do so, open your Windows settings. Navigate to Windows Update. Then Recovery. Under Advanced Startup, click on Restart Now. Once the recovery options are loaded, click on Troubleshoot. Advanced Option, UEFI Firmware Settings. Now click on Restart. After Restart, it will open up your UEFI settings. While on the UEFI interface, navigate to the Security tab. In the Security tab, you will find the TPM and Secure Boot settings. However, the exact location and name of these settings will vary depending on your computer manufacturers. I have a Lenovo desktop. To enable DPM, I just need to click on TCG Features Setup. Now, depending on your motherboard, TPM might be listed under a different name like PTT, FTPM or simply Security Chip. In my case, I need to enable the Security Chip 2.0. Now, go back and enable Secure Boot. Once you have enabled the two features, press F10 to save and exit BIOS. To double check if the two features are now enabled or not, open the system information page. You can see the secure boot is now on. Then press the Windows plus R to open the run dialog. Type tpm.msc and press OK. In the trusted platform module screen, if the status says the TPM is ready for use, then you are good to go. After successfully enabling both TPM and Secure Boot, you can now launch the Valorant game. This time it should run without showing any error. Guys, Vanguard only asks for TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot requirements in a Windows 11 PC. If for some reason you couldn't fix this error, then I'd suggest you play Valorant and other Riot games on a Windows 10 PC. Vanguard doesn't throw this error on a Windows 10 computer.